Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet. And I have to say quickly, I played Pokemon Shining Pearl for six hours yesterday, and got six gym badges. But aside from that, I also traded my... what's it called? Gabite for a Quack... Uh, qu Quackwavel, which is the full evolution of Quaxley. So now we have that, we can also, um... Get some eggs from it to get the full evolution from it. But that means by trading it, I also have... If I get the right thing up... Should press plus or whatever, no, minus, that one. And my Pokedex is now up to 200. So we can go to get a reward for that. Just so many things. I also went to the toilet just before this recording, but I don't remember it ever happening. So I don't know what happened. My brain switched off or something. Whether I have a gap in my memory, whether I I got got serviced or something, I don't know. Serviced as in the kind of I'm a robot kind of way. Had to get repaired. I don't know. But anyway, let's go see what our reward is for getting 200 Pokemon, and then I'll try and get some more of the Quaxquavels evolution chain completed. So where do we need to go? I think it's the biology lab. So let's go do that. There's also quite a few other things we can check out as well, so... I might do that. Maybe. Probably. Probably knowing me. Ah, hello. Hello, Jeremy. I see you've already registered 200 species of Pokemon to your Pokedex for me. Yep. Wow, Pokemon from the mountains, Pokemon from the sea, wait, what? No way! You even found Pokemon in a place like this! Ah, sorry about that, I got a little excited there. My Pokemon research is moving along super duper splendidly, thanks to you. Here, take this, consider it my way of saying thanks. Obtained 20 Quick Balls. That's pretty good. You're a bona fide Pokemon catching professional, Jeremy. For your next goal, oh, it is finally time for you to go for a complete, completed Pokedex. Aim for 400 species. This is no easy feat, but I'm sure you can do it. Keep tossing those Pokeballs and don't give up. I think I can do it. It's just going to take a while because we've only got half of those and we have almost everything in the main storyline done. But I mean, we can, we can do it all. It's not it's not been that difficult to get 200 so far, so that's pretty good. Uh, let's go check out on some things. Let's go to the, the to the director's office to start out. But obviously, I still need to trade for a Sprigatito to train that up and get that uh, registered. Ah, Master Jeremy, how kind of you to stop by. I must say, I am pleased to see you on a school grounds again. Travel and adventure certainly have their place, but it does one good to attend class as well, no? Speaking of which, there is something I would very much like to ask you. I understand you have joined a variety of classes during your time here at the academy. But if I may ask, which of our faculty members have has made you has made the most favorable a favorable impression on you. I don't remember their names. <laughs> you think I remember their names? Probably Mr. Hassel. With the art class. Oh, Mr. Hassel from art class, you say. It should say which class they do as well. But I guess if they make the most impression on you, you should, memor you should know their name anyway, so. Yes, he is a fine teacher, a most passionate and enthusiastic fellow. We are truly blessed to have so many wonderful teachers and staff members at Naranja Academy. I firmly believe that our faculty is second to none in their, their commitment to our studies ongoing, education and well-being. Thank you very much for sharing your thoughts, Master Jeremy. You became even close with Director Clavel. Nice. Now, what else, what else was I thinking? I don't remember. I really don't. 
I don't know why, but it's fine. There's also some Pokemon that you can only get to evolve by trading, so I'm gonna have to trade some more t to get those to evolve. But I need to figure out which, how, like, how many of them I need to do that for. So I can hopefully get them all out at once or something. Anyway, who do I need to talk to here? I didn't check. Staff room is my language teacher. Oh boy. Hello, sir. I've studied, maybe. Oh, Jeremy. Did you come all the way here to the, to the staff room just to see me? Ha, uh, all the way here? Ha <laughs> ha seems I finally made it into the hearts of my students. That makes me... Tress happy. After all, like I said in class, communication is very important. If there's anything you're confused about in class, or if you're having trouble here at the, at the academy, you can always come here and tell me... Ah... <sighs> Tanami Salvatore, your friend Salvatore, that is. You became slightly closer with Mr. Salvatore. I just became more disappointed, but he, he, he got closer. Anyway, let's go to the art room. I'm not against new words, I just want the pronunciations as well. <laughs> Why, if it isn't Jeremy? I have a question for you. Do you find my class difficult? It's just right for me. It's definitely not as difficult as language. That is certainly good to hear. So, Jeremy, you chose to take on the gym. gyms as part of your treasure hunt. That must mean you like Pokemon battles, is that correct? Yeah, I'll take- I'll accept that. One naturally becomes skilled at doing what they enjoy. That must be why you're, you are so strong. Those are wise words. You become stronger at what you enjoy. Ah, do forgive me for springing such an odd question upon you so suddenly. I often find myself pondering the nature of strengths these days. Anyway, thank you again for your input, Jeremy. Just looking at the paintings on the wall. I feel like I'm gonna see like a... an Easter egg on the wall somewhere. So what are you saying about Flabebe? Flabebe come in all kinds of different colors, but I like the red ones the best. Okay. Cool story. I think that's everything else that we need to do except- Nope, there's another one. There's more with Mr. Hassel. Hassel? I don't know. Again, pronunciations. I need- I need the pronunciations and it's- it's hard to know what they are. It might be easier with voice acting. Hello there, Jeremy. I try to visit the schoolyard from time to time. It's good to see young ones with so much energy and vigor. You think so? Oh, yes indeed. Just watching is enough to make even an old man like me feel more alive. Master Hazel, might I have a word? You, what are you doing here? I've told you many times not to bother me here at the, at the academy. Yes, yet I am bound to come. Our family's future is is paramount of uh, of paramount importance. It was good speaking with you, Jeremy. Something important has come up, so I must excuse myself now. Let us discuss this matter elsewhere. Come. Interesting, interesting, very interesting. That just happened. Okay, that's everything. Let's go to the entrance hall and then talk to someone and then check again to see if there's anything new around the school grounds, the academy. Where am I talking to you? Where are you? There's a lot of room here, so. 
Hello, nurse. I see you finally got out of the office. Freedom is finally yours. The door is just a step away. You can leave again. Finally. Oh, hey, Jeremy. Sorry, were you looking for me? I've been away from the nurse's office late lately. I can see that. Did you need something from me? Not really, but I'll... I'll say yes. Are your Pokemon hurt? Just a sec. Wow, I got- I, you gave me a heal. Wow. Here you go! A little first aid. You must really be having an adventure out there. Judging from those scrapes and cuts. Huh? Oh yeah! I guess it is pretty unusual for me to be out of the nurse, nurse's office like this. Are they gonna come get you if you don't leave now? Just asking? Just blink twice if you're in trouble. I think I already made that joke. Hey, well, I'm actually doing a bit of studying. Thought I'd try my best at the health teacher certification exam. One more time. Wow! Just so you know, it's totally not because I, I'm inspired by a certain somebody working hard at their treasure hunt, okay? Well, maybe I am, just a bit. So, you know, uh, thanks. Yeah, hee <laughs> hee. Well, yeah, I don't know. Uh-oh, my break time's almost over. I know you'll be cheering me on, Jeremy. Cool. Well, I guess she has to go back to the nurse's office forever. Anything new because of that now? Nope. Cool. I'm gonna do more classes at some other point in time. Also, I realized something else. If, you, if you're crouching and sneaking around, the music sounds are weird. For some reason, I actually appreciate how this song sounds like this. Just sounds like I'm underwater if I'm like I'm I'm outside of a a building that's got a party going on or something. But anyway, let's head back up this way. I think I'm gonna try. Possibly going over to the lake over there and seeing what this Pokemon is. This dragon type Pokemon, or yeah, dragon terror type Pokemon. Although there's a lot of area to go to. I'll, I'll explore the world eventually. Maybe, I don't know. I just need to complete the Pokedex or something. And also train up my Pokemon. Oh, you're also here. Interesting. Did I not fight you? I thought I did fight you. Also, I need to switch my Pokemon because I completely switched that. Last time I was looking at that, and I also need to... get the other Pokemon I was trying to get as well. But I'll probably do that next time, probably. Just to keep things in order. Or, I don't know, I'll, I'll figure it out. Uh, anyway, let's select all of you. Oh, can I not... Can I not just do that? Why can't I do that? This is this is this is too much. Just going back and forth. Please don't do that. What's my what's my other Pokemon that I had? I had another Pokemon. Just give me a second, I'll figure it out. Maybe. I need to mark my Pokemon on my team so I know which one's which. Ah. Uh... <laughs> Uh oh, Houndoom? No, not Houndoom. I'm sure I'll remember if I see it. I should really be paying I should really know this by now. Yeah, let me put this way. So I can keep figuring out what I'm missing. I should really register the rest of my Pokemon to the team so I know which ones I'm, I have out normally. Where are you? What are you? Box three. I think I've gone through all the boxes now, so I don't know how I don't remember what my... Oh, I remember where it was now. Where's Rev's where's, where's room? Hiding somewhere. <laughs> 
There it is. Okay, we're, we're good. Everything's fine. So I guess I have to move boxes and stuff to be able to set this correctly. Or at least easily. Also, it doesn't seem like it's going to just tell me what's what. Unless I switch to the battle teams anyway, possibly? No. There's just no team seems registered or something. Yeah, I have no teams registered, okay. Let me just do this then. Maybe these are for, like, online battles, maybe. Just to simplify it. Also, hang on, go back to the boxes. I want to check if that stays the same. Yeah, it does keep them marked, which is good. Also, need to put these back in my team. There we go. Okay. Back on track. Now, let me just menu a bit to switch my Pokemon around. See how this goes. To the west. There's a town to the west, but there's an opponent right in front of you. It's crazy. Valentina the cook. What even is that? Ah, Bolivar? Okay. Well, I don't think this is going to be effective, but it's fine. I'll just throw stuff at it. Yeah, that's really not effective, though. Seed Sower. Grass crew to cover the battlefield. That's interesting. Battle Blizzard. Why do you have so many things that you can do? So, so many effects just went off and it's not good for me. So we're going to swap in Skeledurge. Fine. Everything's fine. Skull Touch had its HP recovered. What is going on? Why did that happen? I don't know. Rain Pulse. It's not very effective. Why am I, Why is my HP restoring? Why is its HP restoring? What's going on? Oh, is that because of the grass? No. Can't be. What? I don't know. Anyway, it's fine. Everything's fine. Substitute. Can't remember what that move does exactly, but I think it's normal type. User creates a su uh, substitute substitute for itself using some of its own HP. The substitute serves as the user's decoy. How does that help? I don't know. Depends on how much it uses, but I don't think I want that, probably. I need I need somebody to actually explain that to me. Uh, I don't think I need uproar. User attacks in an uproar for, up for three turns. During that time, no Pokemon can fall asleep. Kind of want to keep headbutt, though, because it may, might make the target flinch. It might have been good for the extra power, though. You're strong regardless of what direction you're headed, huh? Yep. I also bought some more, um... Drinks from the vending machines. Just because it's going to be helpful to have some extra ones. Keep seeing Pokemon. <laughs> it's crazy. I don't know why that's where my brain went. I see Pokemon. In a Pokemon game. I just heard that. Where is it? Hey, where are you? Are you are under the bridge. Oh, you're on that side. That's interesting. I'll grab you. Three Gimmigo coins. Very nice. There's another trainer over here. We can basically just jump into the lake, so... Hey, do you know? I did know. Hey, do you know? Do you know how strong I am? Well, I didn't know that, but now I do. Ricardo the student. I should really switch Pokemon more. Just to my strongest one. I'm 
I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep Rotom. I'm still not sure about it. Okay. Flogus. Keep keep battling. Torch song. Might also be worth going back to any of the towns and cities to see if there's any NPCs that want to trade. Something that I don't have yet. But I'll get to that later on, probably. I mean, we still have 200 Pokemon left to collect, so... I can wait. And so we still have like a third of the map to explore. Probably more than a half. More than a third, actually. It's probably more like a half. I was a... I was just a big fish in a small pond, but you showed me what the ocean is like. Okay. I go this way now. I'm gonna jump into the lake at full speed. Actually, there's probably a lot of Pokemon in the lake. Possibly. There might even be... Trainers in the lake? Why did you do this to me, game? <laughs> Why? Why? Hey there, Jeremy! So, rumor has it, the false dragon titan lurks somewhere in this lake, yeah? But not a single person ever caught a glimpse of it. Must be some kind of kind of truly terrifying beast. But how are we supposed to search for a thing when we don't we don't even know what it looks like? Sure would be handy if it just ran around crying, I'm the Titan! Or something. If only I'm right. If only right. Also, I'm here now, apparently. I was all the way over there. But now I'm here. But where's the caveman? Anyway. I guess I could send out Rotom to try and level it up. Although that didn't work. So. Neither did that. Wow, cool. Great. I'm gonna heal my Pokemons. I don't know if I should be not using revives or not, but it's fine. I'll do it anyway. I'll send out a different Pokemon. Instead for now. See how that goes. Although on the water it might be a different story as to what I send out, so. Why am I so zoomed in? And why is it so slow in the water? What is that thing? What is that thing? What are you? What are you? Massive. Uh, let's send out something else, maybe? I don't know. But look how huge this thing is! Director's Mold Breaker breaks the mold. Dundozo. Dragon Pulse? Soak. Fracture turn it transformed into a water type. Uh, what? <laughs> what? Ha what? Huh? <laughs> you can't do that to me. Please flinch. Nope. Aqua tail. That can't be very effective because I'm... 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 A water type now, apparently. Aqua tail again. Fracture avoided the attack. I'm just trying to bring down itself so I can catch it, maybe. But it's quite high leveled. I possibly need to grind some more. But I feel like I can do this now. That, but that might just be because I was racing in uh, Pokemon Shining Pearl yesterday. I'm still used to racing. I'm going fast. Rain Dance. Interesting. Very interesting. Started to rain. Let's throw a Pokeball. I believe in the Pokeball. It was really working out in Shining Pearl. Just any po Pokeball. Just regular Pokeballs. They just seem to not want to work in this game for some reason. And I don't know what's different. One, two, three. Oh, so close. 
I need to just believe in it. The more I believe, the better the catch rate. Oh, so is that a shiny or is that just orange? I really can't tell the difference, so... So it's wandering away, so I, I, don't, I guess I'll never know. Ah, uh, great ball. Just because of this is taking a bit of time. Why is it so hard to catch Pokemon in this game compared to other ones? Because I know that Pokemon in the background um, has different colors, but I don't know if that orange one was a shiny or not. One, two, three, and caught. Cool. Nice. Well, 201. Seems pretty good. Big catfish Pokemon. <clears throat> I mean, it is pretty big, so... The game is really slowing down in this water. Uh, let me... Check my profile. I'm also going to check the rewards for getting 200 Pokemon. Some XP Candy M. Please. Profile. Still only one shiny, so... It's probably a good thing. Crunchy water. Is that a new Pokemon that I haven't seen before? I think it is. No. Maybe not. Maybe? Yeah, I've already seen this Pokemon before, but that's fine. I'll fight it anyway. Crunchy water. Gonna just run from this quickly before I die. Nasty plot. Please let me let me run. Got away safely, thank you. Gonna switch my Pokemon around again. Because I think Rotom's probably the good good one to send out. For this area. Maybe. Also, there's a lot of stuff here and very crunchy. Which makes it hard to figure out what I'm doing. The loser's mold breaker breaks the mold. Uh, all, all these things are super effective. All of these things are super effective. Wow. Uh, let me Thundershock. I should probably avoid Leaf Storm because it lowers my special attack, which is all that Rotom has. Critical hit. Psycho cut. It is really slowing down here. Super effective again. Oh, there goes Rotom. Great. Even though everything it had was super effective, it just wasn't strong enough. Choose next Pokemon. Go, Fracture. Mold Breaker breaks the mold. Crunch, it's it's super effective. We won. Level up. Gonna heal my Pokemon again. Use a revive. It seems to run smoothly in the menu, or somewhat smoothly in the menu. Not totally smooth, but it's smoother by a little bit. I might also go back to my bag and use some of those candies that we just got. Forty-five, that's pretty good. I want to learn trick. It's a psychic move. User catches the target off guard and, and swaps the target's held item with its own. Now I'm good. That involves a lot of strategy strategizing that I can't really do. Anyway, let's go swimming. Swimming. S swimming. Slowpoke claw. There's a lot of Gyarados in this lake. Guess that makes sense. Actually, is this gonna be like a cool Gyarados? Is the is the thing gonna be a Gyarados? Because that'd be epic if it is. 
I really want to know now. Oh my goodness, it's that Pokemon. Okay, well, I don't know if I need to fight that. 